Hey guys, so I wanted to make a quick guide on how to get through the rogue's den in just over 4 minutes, but without the 80 thieving shortcut. That way you can get your rogue's outfit at lower levels, but still pretty quick and can start getting double gold from thieving as soon as possible. So the first thing you're going to want to grab are Wundo Stamina Potions, so you can drop the vial after you drink it. And then in the beginning you're going to need about 4 doses of a normal energy potion. It's going to go up to about 6 once you start to pick up the pace though. So you're going to want these 3 things for each run you do. Alright, so let's go through a run. So first you're going to drink your Stamina Potion, just make sure you're at full energy before you go in and then you can drop the vial and walk right in. Uh, head over to the bars to start. You can just ignore the traps on the floor and then run over to this thing. Click on the corner of the tiles here and then run straight across. Then you can click on the door. So I put up a little guide on the screen. So you're gonna wanna run to the first green tile and stop and then the next one and stop and then the third one and stop. And then you can keep going. Just click on the ledge over here. So just a quick tip about the traps on the floor, you can actually run across up to three of them without disarming any as long as you stop on the tile before it, which is why we didn't need to disarm any of those traps. So then just run over here to the saw blades and hop across and then run over to these here. Then walk over the beam And then up ahead here, there's four floor traps. So we're going to disarm the first one, and then there's only three more, so we can just run over the rest. So head to the left up here, go in the passageway, and then you can just click right when you get through. Now up ahead, there's a shortcut here. So what you want to do is click on the next passageway, and then you can move your mouse to highlight the one that's way up ahead. So the one you want to click on is behind the one you can see. And then this room right here, you don't have to worry about any of the traps, you can just run right through. Once you're through the door, just click to the edge of the skulls, and then you can run straight over to the ledge. That way you don't have to worry about the blade. Then right here, you want to move over to this tile here, and then disarm one of the wall traps. And then again, there's only three more after this, so you can just run past it. And then here you can click past the saw, and your character will just walk around it. Run over and pick up this tile, and then open the door. Click on the tile, and you're good to go. Um, so here, this might be a bit confusing at first, but honestly, like once you go through it once or twice, you'll pretty much remember the whole way through. Um, so I put up a little guide on screen so you can follow it, but don't worry about it too much because it's pretty easy to remember. But anyways, once you're through, just keep running down the hallway. There aren't any traps in this hallway, so you can just run up here and head around the corner. So right up ahead here, there's a few wall traps, but since there's only three, we can just run by them. So just run up to the corner before them, and then once you stop, you can run past them all. And then there's a door here, but there's only three traps, so we can just run across them. Same thing here, walk next to them, and then you can run across. And then here, just click up ahead here. And then here, we can skip three tiles at a time. So make sure you stop in the middle when you go through. And then same thing up here. So we'll stop right before the trap. And then walk we'll into the middle. And then pass the last three tiles. Alright, so up ahead here is flash powder. Now this used to be a little confusing, but it's actually pretty simple. So you just want to pick it up and use it on the guard. And then when you use it, you want to move your mouse so it's ready to click past him. And then as soon as you see your character stop to throw the powder, just start clicking past the guard and you'll just run by. And then after that, there's just two pendulums that you can just run past and then you're at the wall safes. So you can get your loot and finish up. And that's it. Took just over four minutes and didn't even use the 80 thieving shortcut. So I hope this helps. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.